So this is a very short 10-minute lightning talk about NumFocus. Uh, it's titled, What is NumFocus? Uh, we're at PyCon Canada. It's Saturday, November 12, 2016. And I am James Powell. Uh, I am a vice president at NumFocus. That means I'm an officer to the board. I am a volunteer. Uh, one note that I would say is that everything I'm about to tell you is you know, somewhat unofficial. Uh, if you'd like to email me to ask more about what NumFocus is all about, you can email me at james at numfocus.org. So if you want to figure out what NumFocus is all about, just go to the website, numfocus.org. It'll tell you in greater depth and in a more authoritative voice than what I can tell you. Uh, I, can very tell you I can tell you very briefly, NumFocus is an American 501c3 nonprofit. It's dedicated to fiscally sponsoring and supporting open source scientific computing. We fiscally sponsor projects like NumPy, SciPy, Matplotlib, Jupyter, Pandas, SymPy, Interact, PyMC3, Julia, R OpenSci, Phoenix, Stan, QuantEcon. We run the PyData conference. This year, there have been multiple PyData conferences in London, Berlin, Amsterdam, Paris, Madrid, Chicago, San Francisco, North Carolina, and Washington, DC, and many other projects and conferences. Ultimately, NumFocus focus is about governance and sustainability. What that means is making sure that all of these open source projects that you use as a data scientist, or a scientist, or a research scientist, or a business analyst are maintained in the best interests of the community. They're maintained absent any influence from any one organizational influence or industrial influence, that they are sustainable so that if you choose to, you, to integrate Pandas into a platform that you're building today, you have a guarantee that it'll still be there in 10 years' time, and the governance of that project, decisions that are made that guide that project over time, are made in the interests of its users. But more importantly, I would like to say that NumFocus is an opportunity for action. And I mean this very specifically and without you know, any cynicism, without anything beyond that. It's an opportunity for action. What does that mean? It's an opportunity to help improve the world. As programmers, we have some unique advantages in how we can improve the world. There are many things that we can do in our local communities to make the world a better place, but we also have some very specific skills that can help move the world in the right direction while also doing things that we enjoy doing, writing code, talking to people about open source, talking to people about software. So the question really comes down to, do you love these tools, the tools that I just mentioned? Do you love Pandas? Do you love Python? Do you love Jupyter Notebooks? Do you love Interact? If you do, then there's an opportunity to work with NumFocus to make the world a better place. Do you love PyData? If anyone here has been to a PyData conference and you've seen the power of community, if you've seen the power of community here at PyCon Canada, and you, you say, I'd love to have an event like PyCon Canada, but focus just on the domains of scientific computing and numeric computing, there's an opportunity for you to make the world a better place. Do you love your own local community? When I talked to Peter about PyCon Canada two years ago, one of the things that I said was, it makes sense to have a PyCon Canada in the same year as a big PyCon in Canada. Why is that? Because PyCon Canada is an event for Canadians, run by Canadians, that helps benefit the local community. I'm here visiting from New York City. I'm an outsider. This event is for you. If you love your local community, this is an opportunity for you to benefit that local community. Because PyData, the conference series itself, is all about connecting local communities to a global audience. It's not about erasing your local differences. It's about embracing and, and lifting up local communities in the context of a global community of open source scientific computing users. So what can you actually do? Well, there's actually a lot of opportunities. This is what makes me so excited about NumFocus, what makes me so excited about open source. Because there are an enormous number of things that you can do, big and small, to improve the world, doing things that you already enjoy. Coming to conferences, writing software, talking to people, giving talks. But more specifically, I mean things like organize a PyData. PyData has never held an event in Canada. We may hold an event in Canada in 2017, and the great thing is, if an event does not happen in Canada in 2017, then it might happen in 2018. If not 2018, then maybe 2019. But you can see from events like PyCon Canada that the power of our communities is unstoppable. And one thing that you can do is help us bring a PyData event to Canada earlier. There are actually a couple of people who've talked to me about running a PyData event in Toronto or in Vancouver or in Ottawa. If this is something that you might be interested in, please, I'd like to help you self-organize. Furthermore, PyData events will keep going on in 2017. If there's no opportunity to have an event in Canada, there'll be multiple events in Europe, in 
the United States and hopefully in Asia and in Africa, one thing that you could do is participate in a PyData event. Come and give a talk, come and run a tutorial, come and tell people about open source software. You could run a booth. One thing that we find at NumFocus that's very important is we try and get the message out about open source and open source scientific computing. And there are innumerable events which offer us the space to have a booth. But I can't travel to every single event, and the board can't travel to every single event. And one thing that we want to do is cultivate local people who can say, hey, you know, there's a database event happening in Toronto this weekend, and they'd be willing to let NumFocus have a booth. Let's run a booth there. We'll get some volunteers together, and we'll tell people about why Python is so powerful, why the Python community can create things as amazing as events like PyCon Canada or events like PyData. Or just tell people about open source. I spoke at Strata earlier this year in front of an audience, and there were people in that audience who, to this day, still didn't quite understand what open source is about. They said, all this software you're telling me about, NumPy, Pandas, Jupyter, IPython, is it free? And I had to nudge them a little bit, because I told them, yes, it's free in the sense that you don't have to spend money for it, but open source is not just a vendor you don't have to pay. Open source is about a type of freedom and a type of community building far greater than that. It's about understanding how collective action of individuals can improve the world without necessarily shedding you know, the, the monetary needs of the world, but by embracing all of the things that we can do together that don't include some of the you know, unfortunate side of you know, industrial programming. And lastly, one of the things that you can do is contribute to a project. And this is something that not everybody has an opportunity to do, not everybody's interested in. Contributing to a project is a very difficult thing to do. It takes a lot of commitment. But if you're interested in contributing to any of the projects that I listed, please let me know. Because fundamentally, and this is, I think, the most important part of this entire lightning talk, many people might disagree, but I believe the world is becoming a better place. Sometimes we have step backs. Sometimes things move in a direction we don't like. But the world that I have seen in the time that I've been alive, even within the small context of the open source community, the Python community, the PyData community, the NumFocus community, it's getting better. It's getting better and better and better. Events like this are getting stronger. Our community is getting stronger. The ties that we have between each other are getting stronger. The world is becoming a better place. And small things like contributing to NumFocus is one way that you can be part of this change. Thank you so much.